Happy New Year! Hey guys, my name is Keaton, and I hope you all have an awesome and safe New Year. It is officially 2023. I cannot believe we've made it to this year. Like, we made it past through 2022. I gotta say, that was crazy. Hope you guys had a, a great New Year. Um, and I wanted to tell you, um, 2022 has been a best year of my life. And it's all thanks to you guys. And, you know, I just hope you all had a great 2022. Because if not, hopefully 2023 will be will be an even better year. Because, yeah, um, if not, oh well, doesn't matter. We'll just keep moving forward. But... I am really excited to see what what this year is about. Um, I know there are some parts I'm excited for, um, and probably some part that I'm not really excited for. But I don't want to make it like too personal. I just want to like I don't want to go too much detail because it's personal. Um, so I will tell you. Um, let's get through with some of uh, not excited ones. So. I think for a not exciting part is um, probably start finding a part-time job, which we're which probably about to find one soon. Not really that excited, honestly, but again, I don't want to talk about it too much. I don't want to make it more detail about it. I want to keep it personal, um, but let's go on with some exciting things. So um, what I'm excited for this year. Uh, is that we're gonna have some uh, we're gonna have new games coming out this year as well as a new movie you could say I mean like I'm pretty excited for uh, the Super Mario Bros movie that's going to be coming out in three more months kind of excited but not really that excited I'm pretty nervous for that movie since I know it's already like um, you know, just um, get, just some part I'm getting nervous about. Um, I am also about to move to another another place, probably a townhouse or maybe apartment. I would say since I've been living apartment um, at the Oregon since um, since started the pandemic, and then I've been living this apartment that I'm living here in in Seattle um, only for a year. Um, which I'll probably, which I'm gonna be start moving to other places, uh, somewhere beginning of summer. So uh, yeah, um, let's see here. With that out of our way, um, let's get on to what game, what games I'm excited for. Um, I think the games I'm excited for is uh, Kirby's Return to Dreamland. I uh, Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe for the Nintendo Switch. I know they did the, uh, the Wii version 12 years ago, which now I'm randomizing to 12 years now. Um, I haven't played it, but I watched uh, YouTubers did a walkthrough on that. Um, and, and now we have a Switch remake called Deluxe that's coming in February, which is next month, which I'm excited for. Um, and then, uh, let's see here. Oh, I'm excited for Tears of the Kingdom. The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom coming in May 12th of this year. That will be like uh, four more months. Yeah, four more months. Um, and then, um, yeah, I think that's all I have. Um, you know, I just want to make a video to, you know, for New Year 2023. Just talk to you when I'm excited, not excited for. I already talked about what I'm not excited for. But I still want to like keep it to myself because I don't want to go too much detail because it's personal. So I would, so I suggest uh, for me, I would just keep it to myself, and I want you guys to understand that I don't want to make it too personal about the video. Um, but I will. But even though I already tell you that already, um, but I might say it again anyways. <laughs> um, but yeah, we'll see how this year 2023 is going to be about. Um, but I hope you guys have a, like, you know, I just hope you all have a, a good 2023 year. Um, hopefully you're you're excited for 
uh, what's coming up this year uh, because if there's something that you're excited and not excited about let me know in the comments below and I'll be happy to read you guys' comments about what you're looking forward to this year and what you're not excited for this year so uh, yeah I think that's all I have for the video I don't know what else to talk about but uh, however um, I will let you know um, I know I already saw the comments from Anthony Taylor about I should play Twaga Princess on Hero Mode, which it won't be on the Wii version. There's no Hero Mode on the Wii version, but they have a Wii U version instead. Um, which I do hope Nintendo would. I don't know if it would happen. I feel like not. Maybe since I've been hearing leaked rumors about. Um, but I would say for this year, either before or after Tears of the Kingdom to come out. I say they should do uh, the Wind Waker Twilight Princess on the Nintendo Switch, since I've been seeing leaked rumors about it, but I but I don't know if that's gonna happen. I don't know, but we'll find out. Um, I am thinking about playing Skyward Sword on Hero Mode on the Nintendo Wii, so I could just go through with, you know, after that, then I'll go through, you know, I just want to go through the order of when it came out 2011 to 2000 um you know whatever year like 16 for the wii u version but more likely 2021 <laughs> but um uh, but anyways um i don't i don't want to sit here and ramble too long uh happy new year everybody i uh, hope you guys have a great new year and uh, leave a like if you're excited to see what's coming up for the video and uh if you're new to my channel and want to see more videos and content, feel free to subscribe to turn on notification bell so y'all can be notified. And feel free to, you know, let me know down in the comments below what are you guys excited for this year and what are you not excited for this year. So, thanks for watching. See you all in the next video. Bye!